Welcome to my channel. I'm Mr. Vincent, and this is Mr. Vibes K-Pop. I'm back. We're getting right into it. I did not know TXT was coming out with a new song or even an EP. I've been gone for a while, and um, I am looking forward to this. Let's get into it. Well, deja vu. Like a movie. Very cool. Oh, wow. This feels very Western. Yeah, I mean, it's really different. Really different. What do y'all think in the comments? Let me know, man. Do you feel like this type of energy for a song compared to like um, Sugar Rush and, and all those type of songs where the energy is different and their vocal colors have more of a chance to, to be expressed compared to like this rap line stuff? Let me know. We already know they're great performers, great dancers and stuff like that. We know they can sing. But they have so many colors in their voice. Do you feel this is what they should be doing right now? I mean, I like it. It's a vibe. But it's so similar to what I hear on the Western side. I like what the guitars was cool. Give them a little dance break so they're able to do what they got to do. I don't know. Let me know. I haven't listened to the to the samples yet to the album. Is the whole album like this? Tomorrow and together. Tomorrow X together. Deja vu. What you thinking about it? Pretty long, right? Video. What is it? It's like uh, it's more like um, alternative popish based, right? Like a rockish. Or no. I'm going to put my finger on it. Is it like the other videos where it's like visually like, oh, wow, this is, this is, this is crazy. It's amazing. No, but this is like a, just a chill. I feel it's like indie vibe-ish. You know what I mean? Like what an independent would put out, you know, it's not too produced, you know, not overly produced. But it still sounds good. You know what I mean? But again, this is just my opinion. 
I mean, I understand they need to have a different concept, different change, which is fine. It's just what I'm understanding with K-pop now. It's like K-pop being that it has so many concepts. Once I start getting into a group, and I'm like, okay, I like this, I like this, and then they switch it up, and then I'm like, oh man. It's like K-pop could get away with that because it's concept related, but if you took a regular artist that that has their own their own lane, and how they put out music, and then they totally switch it up on you, you're like, yo. This isn't them. This doesn't fit. You know, this doesn't fit with who they are. This isn't the person that I, I've been, you know, supporting for the past 10 years. This is something else. So that's the part that I'm learning about, you know, listening to K-pop for the past, you know, year and a half or whatever every day that I have to understand that. But again, if you vibe out to it, that's all that matters, man. Because this is Mr. Vibes K-pop channel. You're here to vibe out. You're here to ex experience it. Have fun. And, and just enjoy it with me. And discover it. Thank you for all the love and support. Please like and subscribe. It helps my channel get views. Helps YouTube make it grow. To make my platform get bigger. So a lot of the right people. People with K-pop in their heart. Can see. The good channel compared to being stuck watching all the ones that are forced down their throats that they just do it for, for views and money and whatever other reason. It is what it is. But I'm Mr. Vincent and this is Mr. Vibes K-Pop. I'll see you in the next one.